Adam Lerner and today we are at back at New York Fashion Week. Today is day three and we are here backstage at Rebecca Taylor. In fact, that is Rebecca Taylor right over my right shoulder there, left shoulder, sorry. And she's obviously conducting an interview, very, very high in demand. She's an amazing designer. Uh, I've been covering her shows for a whole bunch of seasons now and she never disappoints. Her shows are always really exciting, top models, beautiful looks. Um, this is the spring 2012, so we're going to get some really interesting interesting stuff, all kinds of like embellished dresses and all kinds of stuff. We'll show you those kinds of things as well. But I just wanted to give you guys a sense of what this is like. This is maybe a couple hours before the show. The excitement is brewing. You've got the designer right there being interviewed on the step and repeat over there. We've got all the looks behind us getting prepped for the models. The models are getting their hair and makeup done. In fact, we're going to go over there in just a minute. So stay tuned and we're going to go and give you a little bit of a glimpse backstage. And we're back. And right now, if you can tell, we are backstage at the Rebecca Taylor show um, right over my left shoulder as I remembered this time um, we've got hair and makeup going on and specifically makeup over here but it's it is just chaos there are people coming in and out of here it's almost like an ant colony because it's organized chaos everybody has a job everybody's in a rush everybody's doing something there's so many moving parts to this I mean you have so little time to get this coordinated. We're in New York City, it's a crazy city, it's a crazy weekend. In fact, everything is blocked off. The streets are blocked off. Everyone is prepping for this 9-11 memorial and event that's, good. well, not event, but obviously people are prepping for 9-11. So Lower Manhattan is being shut down. Traffic is completely crazy. Everybody's running late. Models are running late. And then everybody kind of descends on this place and it is complete chaos. Complete chaos. As you can see, you, there are people just constantly milling about, go, going in and out of this place. You can't even imagine the amount of stress and intensity that's back here. But the amazing thing about this is that in just a little over an hour's time, everybody is going to be out on that runway looking incredible and putting on an amazing show. So I just wanted to give you guys another example or another look into the backstage world of Fashion Week here in New York City. Stay tuned and we'll be showing you a whole lot more.